called a mortar. A magic wand that grants every soldier's wish. Awesome, right? You see in this? Isn't that... Say, who's in charge of the squad? Gotta say, I'm impressed at how quickly they were able to change their tactics on the fly. Uh, well... Hmm? Wait, Raz? What are you doing in the Edinburgh army? We enlisted together to protect Galia. No way! Lena? Small world, huh? Oh, sorry. I'm going by Kai now. Wait, Kai? Uh, but that's your... Riley. really get it, but okay. I'll call you Kai. Anyway, it's so amazing to see you. What are the odds of seeing old friends in a foreign war zone? Beats me. How'd you end up in joint operations anyway? Since you asked so nicely. <clears throat> I'm Lieutenant Riley Miller. After majoring in Ragnite Engineering, the Army brought me on as an artillery advisor. I've been temporarily transferred from the field artillery team for this joint operation. As long as I'm here, I'll provide the fire support you need to take down the Empire. My knowledge is your power. Just what our squad needed. We appreciate the support, Riley. So, where's the commander? I wanted to introduce myself. Uh, about that. It's not just us two in this squad. Huh? You mean Kai's here after all, or...? Riley, I'm the commander of Squad E. Oh, you're pretty young for an officer. But I was impressed out there. My knowledge is your... <sighs> Claude... Wallace... All you have to say? I can't believe I took orders from this coward. Screw that! Um, well... <sighs> Chapter 2. The Liberation of Rain. For meritorious action and capturing... Listen up, everyone. I'd like to introduce a new member of Squad E. Connor Doherty. I'm writing a book. Uh, a w Ryan Fort, mercenary. You pay, I shoot. Since the start of Operation Northern Cross, the Federation's elite forces, Squad E among them, were driving back the Empire, one victory at a time. Yet, the further they cut into Imperial territory, the more tenuous the supply chain. And so, the Federation Army established a series of massive outposts along the front line. A Lindbergh base. Commanded by the 101st Division, this outpost would prove itself a vital logistics hub the battles to come. Wow. This is our new base? It's incredible! Apparently, these facilities can accommodate over 3,000 soldiers and 100 tanks. On top of that, they have enough food, fuel, and ammo to supply every squad on the front line. Impressive. More like a dream come true. If I didn't know better, I'd think we were still in Federation territory. 
guess the brass can get stuff done when they ask. What's the deal, though? They got all these resources and we're still stuck with one busted-ass tank? Excuse me? Our squad takes excellent care of the Hoffman. I have to admit, this really puts the scope of our mission into perspective. Hell yeah! With this much heat, the imps are gonna feel the burn. No, we've barely seen the tip of the iceberg. Even all this might not be enough. Oh, you think? Way to rain on our parade, Commander. Hey, who's that? They got some weird get-ups. Oh, those are Navy uniforms. That's a surprise. What are naval troops doing this far inland? Well, I salute them for swimming all the way here. <laughs> Whoa! -ho -ho! Check out the ass on that one! I'd swab her deck. Uh, hold up, Raz! I'm just gonna say hi. Break the ice, you know? He's hopeless. I just hope he doesn't get into trouble. Don't hold your breath. Yeah. Anyway, we still have some time before the meeting. I'm gonna go take a look around. Whoa! Claw! The perks of working in a fa If there's anything you ever want to upgrade, we'll build all... Claude, what do you think? Wow, a masterpiece! All done, Claude. Whoa, it turned out great! Wow, a master! Isn't it? Once we're there, you are. I've been charged with Squad E's training. As ranking lieutenant, I'll be giving strict instruction to each combat class. The experience you gain in the field goes towards refining our abilities. I want to see growth from all combat classes. Each time a class makes a breakthrough, every squad member of that class will show improvement. Now show me what you're made of! You're not done yet! Do you want to win or don't you? so to speak. Good work. Look at that. The Lancers have... Hmm. Just do it! Push those limits! You've leveled up, so to speak. Good work. 
Well, well. Your shock troopers have... Hmm. Your tr... Hmm. You've proven you... Ah, yes. When combat classes rise in level, sometimes the soldiers show new potentials. You could say potential... Orders are... The thing about... Use your orders judicious. That's all from me. I so this is the command center. I'll need the right balance of combats. First things first. That should do it. Preparation's a vital part of any battle. Glad to see you're on time, Claude. Tour the base yet? Yeah. Compared to the old camps, this is heaven on earth. Excellent. I expect you to put all this funding to good use. Sir, the commanders of squads A through I have assembled. Then let's get down to business. I know squad E just arrived, but we already have marching orders. Our mission is to capture a small town northeast of here. According to reports, Rain is one of the enemy's most valued comm centers. Which is why it's being guarded by a tank platoon. That complicates things. Squad E is mostly infantry. Do we have the right equipment for urban and anti-tank warfare? Don't worry. This time you'll have fire support. Once you infiltrate the city, Simply relay the tank's coordinates to the field artillery team. I see you already thought this through. We also received intel that the Empire is inflating their numbers with decoys. If we can discern the real tanks from the fake, Rain is as good as ours. Excellent work, Lieutenant. I'm glad I can depend on you. You flatter me, sir. <laughs> Impressed? Control info and you control the war. Join ops, huh? Coordinating with the fire support unit is gonna make or break this mission. <laughs> Try to minimize collateral damage. We plan on repurposing their gear for our own comm center. Minerva, you are to lure the enemy troops as far away from the city as possible. Consider it done. Squad E will then sneak in and gather intel for the field artillery team. Understood, sir. Yo, I hear we're moving out already. Oh, shame. I just scored a hot date with a Navy babe. <laughs> you wish. You got shut down. Hard. Uh, you were watching? Raz, what you do in your spare time is up to you. But when you're on duty, you represent the army. <laughs> Who are you, my mom? <laughs> Feels like it sometimes. Anyway, you said we'd have fire support. Does that mean it's a joint operation? You guessed it. <sighs> hey, looks like you're still alive. I'm glad you're okay, too. They told me you'll be commanding my team. Oh, really? Well... Spare me. I already requested a transfer. Uh, oh. But orders are orders. Until my transfer goes through, you're in charge. Not that I expect real leadership from a scaredy clod. <sighs> what do you know, Riley? come lately? You just got here. All bark and no bite as always. You mind shutting up while the grown-ups talk? What the hell? 
It's been 10 years and that's how you greet an old friend? Hi there, Riley. I know it's not my business, but Claude, uh, Lieutenant Wallace is a great commander. None of us would have made it this far without him. We trust him with our lives. And since we'll be working together, maybe you should... I should trust him? I'm sure it's all sunshine and rainbows while you're winning. But when the chips are down... Running away is probably all he can manage. Cut it out, Riley. <sighs> the Empire took your family from you. Not Claude. He's grown up since then. Judge him for who he is now. Leave it be, Kai. But... It's all right. Words can't change the past. We'll just have to rebuild. Rebuild what? Our trust. Huh? Riley, I'm gonna show you how much I've changed. At least give me a chance to prove myself. Let's make one thing clear. Unless it's for the mission, I do not take orders from you. Riley... Give me a break. 